easy it is to make and Hey guys, so welcome back and please excuse the noise. My dad is currently washing my our car and I've decided to film this video right now. So you may have noticed that I did put some makeup finally for once. I put some makeup on and yeah, so today I've filmed a really exciting video. I know how much you guys love clever DIYs and I finally came up with one. So today I'll be showing you guys how to make a bodysuit. This one that I'm wearing right now. And all you will need is, like the usual, a sewing machine and a pair of leggings. And I would um, recommend a those shiny pair of leggings and I know that some of you guys will ask me if I did put pads on in this but a bodysuit does not come with a with pads you have to wear it with without a bra and it does sound like really like what but it really depends on you if you don't want to if you want to wear a bra go ahead or so I forgot to film the part where I'm trying on the leggings for you guys and the part where I am cutting open the pair of leggings but it's pretty simple and I hope you guys are still gonna understand the rest of the video without those parts also don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this video it would mean a lot a whole lot for me and let's just jump right in so this is a pair of leggings that we will be working with. As you can see, it is really shiny, but we will be using the other side for the bodysuit. So if you're wondering how did I get to these two pieces, I simply cut wherever there was stitches and it gave me two perfectly um, identical pieces. Then I laid down my swimsuit because, you know, swimsuits and bodysuits are pretty much similar and I traced down the shape that I wanted. Then cut what you trace down, leaving one, one inch of seam allowance for the sides. After cutting vertically the half of the bodysuit, I will be folding it in two so I can now cut the other half so they can be identical. Now I'm pinning down my front piece of bodysuit on the other um, piece of leggings and once again cutting out the shape. Okay, so here you're supposed to lay down your two pieces right sides together, but as you know, I'm Kelly and I always manage to do some stupid errors, but you know what I, what I sew right sides together. And then you're gonna sew the sides, the shoulders. And your little body part. So after everything is sewn, I'm just going to go back and find the exact shape that I want my body suit to be. I'm making the neck hole very big so, I, so I'm able to like slide in into my body suit. But yeah. Then I'm adjusting my arms. So for the back, I am cutting it really low since I want a really low style back. Mm -hmm. 
So the last part is for your special body part. I'm just cutting a piece to cover the seam allowance just to make it more comfortable when you're wearing your bodysuit. And you're pretty much done. But if you're not really satisfied with the straps like I am, I'm going to be showing you guys a second way to do the straps. So what I'll be doing is just taking um, the excess fabric of the leggings and cutting two long pieces to do the straps. Then lay down the right side and fold it and sew the edge. Then take a safety pin, pin the opening, and then just loop it so you can turn the strap inside out to reveal a decent strap. So it will look like that and then what you're gonna do is just take your bodysuit and cut, cut off the strap. Make sure that it does continue with your low back like that. Then you're gonna take your strap and then position it wherever you want it to be. So for the front, since the material is not really solid, well, what I will be doing is just cutting a little square piece to cover both sides of the strap and then sew like a box shape thing around it so it can be more solid. So we're pretty much done with the this DIY bodysuit and I'm so happy with the result. It looks exactly like I wanted. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this a thumbs up and subscribe if you did this video. And don't forget to check out my Instagram at Kelly. If you're interested, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.